Alicia. Today I'm going to be doing a simple makeup look. It's like a chit chat get ready with me on my face. No, I'm just doing like a get ready with me basically and I'm just going to be talking through it, spilling some tea. So without further ado, let's get in with the video. So the first thing I'm going to use is my Ponds Dry Scrub. Ponds Dry Skin Cream. Um, I'm using this because, as you guys can see, I'm very, very dark. Because I'm at, like, the beach basically all week. And my skin is dry. <laughs> yeah, I usually just, like, take it on, like, the knuckle of my finger. Because I don't really like touching my face with my fingers, fingers. You know what I mean? I don't know. Kind of weird. Then I just massage that all in. Have you guys heard of the whole Olivia Jade's mom? Like, I feel, honestly, I feel so bad for Olivia and her sister Bella. Like, I know I shouldn't feel bad because it's like, why would her mom do that? Oh, if you guys don't know what I'm talking about, basically Olivia Jade's mom and dad paid $500,000 to um, the USC... Anyways, it's the college that Olivia goes to. They paid the college um, on like the sports team and they said like, here's money, like say she'll be on crew, which is like rowing and she'll like play for the team. Like basically it's like recruitment and she never did. So that's like not okay. Cause like she got into the school because like she was supposed to be on crew, but she's like not, which is not okay. Um, anyways, that's against the law. So Olivia Jade's mom is in like a lot of trouble. And basically right now they arrested the dad, just arrested the mom. And that's all I know right now. But like that is tea. Like I feel so bad for her. Like, oof, I couldn't even imagine. And, like, I know some people are gonna be like, but Why do you feel bad for her? Like, she's a spoiled brat. Honestly, I don't think she asked her mom to, like, pay $500,000 to a school. Like, like, that's just so sad. Like, I couldn't imagine my mom paying for me to get into a school because, like, she didn't think I was, like, smart enough or something. Um, I'm using my Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer Potion. But if you go under Olivia Jade's Instagram, the comments on her photos are so mean. I honestly don't understand why people write mean things about other people on social media. Like, first off, cyberbullying. <laughs> Still a real thing. And second off, like, why do people care? I would never take time out of my own day to write something out. Now I'm going in with my tartlet and then I'm going into cashmere. This is like my go-to color. But I don't understand why people would take the time out of their day to go on her Instagram and just like comment the rudest stuff. Like your first spoiled brat. I'll just pop up right here like what some of her comments look like right now. I just think the whole situation is very sad. Like I don't think her mom did the right thing obviously now i'm going in with my uh, um powder and with my little kabuki brush um, and then i'm just gonna put this powder all over my face anyways i just don't think it was the right thing to do on her mom's part on anyone's part basically but i don't think olivia should be the one to blame in this because it's like obviously the parents fault. Where's my brush? This is my favorite brush if anyone cares. Okay, now I'm going in with my Maybelline Fit Me powder. But I usually go under my eyes because like I always have like bags under my eyes. So I put this underneath my eye. It's basically like a concealer but like powder formed. That's what I use it for at least. I am so happy to say that I am on spring break. Oh, yeah, I'm on spring break. I'm like so, 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 so excited to be free. Um, but I do have 
two papers no three papers to write um today so i could cry or i could just do it but i'll probably just cry about it which i know i'm a baby but like it's fine but i'm excited for spring break i'm so excited for summer like i could throw up but i won't <laughs> now i'm going in with my Too Faced Too Faced chocolate <laughs> sorry uh my chocolate bronzer in medium deep I am so obsessed with this bronzer. I'm obsessed with almond makeup, honestly. But this lasts me so long. Do like a little bit right here, a little bit right here. And then I like to go up here with it. And then obviously all on my forehead because I like to look tan. There's nothing wrong with that. I sometimes, I don't contour my nose, but I thought it'd be fun for the video. So we're going to try and contour my nose. But I'm so happy you guys liked my video on, oh, my week in my life at Flagler. Ew, I'm a booger and no one told me. Oh, no, that's just dry skin. Love that. Um, everyone's been liking my Flagler week in my life video. If you guys haven't seen it, it'll be in the down box below. Definitely go check that out. But it was really fun to film. I didn't think I could do like a full week of filming, but I did which is insane to me. Did I accomplish anything? No, but it's fine, it's fine. It's the thought that counts. Moving on to eyebrows. I do this in every single one of my makeup videos. It's the same thing. I know people come at me sometimes. No one comes at me, but. This is how I do my eyebrows. I just take my Too Faced palette that was like from three Christmases ago, and then I go in with this like dark and then I just fill them in with my eyeshadow. Oh man. And look at that. If you mess up, you can just like, and it's gone, you know? Like literally the easiest makeup tutorial, get ready with me, you'll ever see in your life. Oh, that's very nice, very nice. Last thing I do, um, I really know I don't need this, but We'll be a little girl. Okay, I'm trying to film. Shh. We'll be a little girly and add some blush. I'm going in with the same. That was such a beauty guru thing. Um, my same palette, the Too Faced one, and then I'm going in with this like Stardust blush. And just like, yes, I'm a girl. Oh my god, that was a lot. Last thing to do is curl me lashes. And then I put on mascara. Oh. I have no plans for the spring break. Um, I just want to go to the beach, but like the weather is not nice, like at all. Okay, now I'm going in with my L'Oreal Paris Voluminous. I'm like obsessed with this mascara too because it's like clump, clump free, and it's like so dark. I only do it on the top of my eyelashes. Like, I don't do my bottom eyelashes because I just think it makes me look very tired. I think that's, like, the last thing I want in this world is to look tired because I look tired 24-7. Um, and that really wouldn't help my aesthetic, you know? Like, look at these lashes. I usually wear fake lashes, but I ruined my last pair. My eyeballs are really, really short. So I cut my eyelashes, not like my real ones, my fake ones, and I cut them too short and uneven basically. So I had to throw them out, which was like really, really sad. Look how long. Close up. No, but I think they look a lot longer with this mascara. If I do say so myself. Yeah, and then the last thing I normally do is to make myself look more like a girl and less than a gorilla. I go in with my Paradise Highlighting Kit from Bad Habit and I just take, not that brush, I take this brush, which is like really small, and then I just put it in my like tear duct area. It really doesn't make a difference, but to me it does. It's like literally the simplest, easiest. My hair looks greasy, but it's not. I just washed it. Oh, my life is a mess. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for getting ready with me. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Check out my last video I posted, which was my week in my life. 
probably one of my favorite videos I've ever done. So go check that out. I just wanted to say thank you guys so much for 900 subscribers. Like, that is so crazy to me. We're so close to a 1,000. But thank you guys anyways for subscribing and watching my videos. It literally means so much to me. You guys don't even know. And yeah, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.